Hello, welcome back to RimWorld, uh, where we left off. This is a little bit past that. Um, I forgot to hit record. We are in a situation where we are uh, recovering slowly but surely. We have a couple people that are still in catatonic states. Uh, Bonnie is doing better now, uh, but we are still kind of mentally recovering. Uh, we have a lot of people in a cathartic state. And they're starving. We do have a trader joining us right now. So I think one of the things we can do here is take advantage of the fact that we have a trader on the map. Let's first trade with them. Let's see what we can sell. I think we can sell all of this light leather, plain leather, wolf. Sell all the human leather. I don't think we need any of that. Uh, sell the chem fuel. I don't think we need that either. Sell the gold. I would like to buy... What can we buy from them? And not just sell. So, we need some of this to make... All right, we need some of that to make more advanced uh, healing stuff. But I think that's good. I think we could end up <clears throat> just getting some silver, which is not necessarily a bad thing. Um, I think we should take advantage of this time while we have it to try and go after some of these alpha beavers and maybe lure them down this way. Who is extreme break risk? You are. Okay. Okay, so we got some Alpha Beaver revenge going on here. If Bonnie can make it back, I think all the Alpha Beavers <coughs> are Manhunter now. So if Bonnie can get back into the base, uh, Daniels, you get back in the base as well. We will let them deal with the Alpha Beavers. I'm all about that. Yeah. So here we go. What type of gear do you have? Alright, so what do we got going on with the... All right, that doesn't need to be a prisoner. We can actually try to rescue this guy. And get some goodwill. How's his health? Not great, but we also need to make sure we're only using garbage medicine with him. I think that's easy enough to do. Okay, so we still have a couple alpha beavers on the map. think we should try to bait them as well.
Did I kill it? No, I injured it. But it'll die. Alright, what's going on with this alpha beaver over here? He's just malnourished. So this guy's going to chase me. Theoretically all the way back to my base. Okay. What's your needs? Okay, so the last alpha beaver is right here. He's hit, but not anywhere close to dying. <laughs> we could just run around the base like this, and it's going to get these guys. All right, so we need to, <laughs> we need to put that fire out. For sure. That needs to be pretty high priority. But that uh, just indirectly took care of our uh, alpha beaver situation. So that is good. Let's extinguish the fire on this goose. And there goes the caravan. So we are in pretty good shape there. That worked out uh, better than I anticipated. I do want to get rid of this and maybe we'll build a structure steel walls probably the best bet we'll have to deconstruct this and we're going to need to make steel traps i think That should be pretty fair. Let's make a copy. <coughs> we'll ultimately build that there. When she wakes up, she will just need to start mining some more of this compacted steel. So we can get this done. I would like to get this stone cutters table done daniel should be able to work on that pretty soon that way i can start cutting stone and using that this should Help replenish our steel that we are using up on this. Let's add a bill here. Make any stone blocks do forever. I think that's fair enough anyway. Let's make a little stockpile zone. Maybe we can add a like important priority. And we will make this... Stone blocks? No. Chunks. So how do we make stone chunks? Unfinished. Uh, not items. Chunks. Stone chunks. That's what we want. Stone chunks there. What's, what's old Bonnie doing here? Getting some recreation. She needs to be cooking some food. We need to get some butchering done. Alright, Daniel has been saved. 
hopefully when he walks off the map, it'll give us some some bonus. Perfect. So we can clear prioritize work there. He needs to start building this stuff up before the next raid, which I'm sure will be any time now. mine up some of this steel down there. We are continuing our research. Muffalo meat has rotted away in storage. Okay, so we are back to <coughs> being able to grow stuff. We probably should spend a little time planting. Uh, that was not very smart of that person. Let's go to the research screen. We just researched pemmican. We should probably research tree sowing because, or sowing, uh, because we seem to be <coughs> always running out of trees. So that could be hugely beneficial. How's their health? Uh, just ibex busted their leg it looks like okay so we need to reprioritize planting because i think that is something that needs to be done as fast as possible This is getting a little questionable here. Definitely have to clean up the mess before we do any more cooking. I don't think we need to worry about um, refueling the fire here for temperature reasons anyway, because it's getting to a tolerable point. Bonnie's back to reprioritizing, it looks like. Uh, she's going to do planting first and foremost. Uh, rare thrombos. I don't think we're in a position to do anything about those, but I guess it's good to know they are there. I think we should try to attack this lynx. Uh, not with melee, that's for sure. Let's put on an auto pistol. Ran right through all the traps. It's perfect. Alright. There we go. So I don't think we could tame anything yet. We definitely need to finish constructing this stuff because this is very high priority. We 
No, I worry more about the building. Maybe construction should be your number one priority. Let's build a copy there. Will you stop walking away as I'm telling you to build stuff? Okay, so that now, that trap path is set, which is good. Bonnie probably needs to butcher. I think we need to lower the hunting priority for Daniel. And maybe even the hauling. She should be cooking, though. How is... Alright, so we need some heal root. And that is something we should probably start growing. But there is some on the map somewhere, I'm sure. So let's take a look. Maybe not. I'm not seeing any. <laughs> Alright, so maybe we need a zone. Maybe we need to build a small growing zone for some heel root. I think that's a fair. What's her skill in plants? It's eight, so she should be able to do it. Posting an ally. Uh, his friend. Oh, so 21 days. I have to give him a quality accommodation. I mean, I doubt that's going to happen. But it's possible, I guess. I'm sure you're happy. Nothing... Nothing negative, really. I mean, a, a stab scar, but that's... <laughs> I mean, we might as well try to do it. So our guest can stay here. All right, slate and limestone. We do slate end table. Slate dresser. All right, dragon, you're not going to be too happy with the state of things, but uh, maybe I'm going to make her cleaning a high priority, too, because this is getting a little questionable. Uh... So how did that become the primary ideation? Oh, because we temporarily have somebody who is that. Not too sure how I feel about that. I need slate blocks. So we can haul these. 
back to the storage here. And then Daniel should work on that because they are the closest thing. Yes. So that should give me enough slate. Hopefully. We'll see. Okay. They gave us some slate. We could work on that now. What is going on with Bonnie? She should be okay on cooking. I really wish she would focus a little more on planting. Maybe once she gets to 10, she'll reprioritize and start planting stuff. Yeah, it looks like it. I think I might change that to be five, just so she doesn't spend so much time doing it. But I guess if she's chipping away at it, it'll be fine. What's his mood? <laughs> Not above 50. 38%. So this meat's going to rot away. What is the story with I guess maybe dragon can let's try doing a fair. Maybe that'll make people a little happier or it'll fail and make people miserable. We'll see what happens. It was fun. So Krika's cleaning seems to be doing something. Dragon's uh, average happiness does not seem to be getting much better, unfortunately. Uh... Let's prioritize making some more blocks so we can put a slate floor. So she can start laying down the, the flooring and Daniels can focus on building it. I'm hoping that will be the room he chooses to go in. I do want to haul these. So Krika should reprioritize hauling. He do have some sandstone stuff being made. Maybe we could do some sandstone in this area. We are getting some planting out of the way, which is good. <clears throat> we definitely need to grow probably more crops this season than we, we did last one. We barely made it through the winter. This meat's going to spoil pretty soon. What's Mr. Daniels doing here? So why isn't Dragon... Can we assign a specific... Yeah. <laughs> Dragon, go sleep there. I don't know why you're not sleeping there. That should bump up your mood. His average mood needs to be above 50. Which is definitely not... <laughs> happening anytime soon.
let's get some construction going here. I don't know why he's hovering around this area in particular. We do have a decent amount of sandstone, so... These are not beautiful. Okay, so apparently... I need to not do this. And I need to do... Slate tile instead and then sandstone tile can be over here who has a major break risk Kraka? What's wrong with Krika? We are out of wood. I anticipated that being a problem. Do we have wood on the map? We do have some wood on the map. Those alpha beavers did not uh, did not get everything. Although we are gonna chop pretty much everything down let's prioritize harvesting these trees <laughs> and we'll do some cooking Daniels is finishing constructing I need to build that door frame too. This meat's gonna spoil very soon, so she definitely needs to focus on cooking. That'll reset the timer from three hours to five days or four days. Okay, he seems to be a lot happier in this area, for sure. It's a little unfortunate that his mood is depend like part of his mood is uncovered groin uh which isn't really our fault because he kind of came like that all right so we got some angry huskies they are approaching from the north which is good because we have a lot of uh a lot of our supplies up there <coughs> feel like we need to build a uh where is it I don't think it has to be slate I think it could be I mean certainly nothing is wrong with using slate it's just doesn't have to be that. So we need to get up here, I think. These man hunting huskies are going to be a problem. I think when they go to sleep, they will lose their manhunter status. That is my hope anyway. There's one down. So Bonnie is sick. She probably just needs to go to bed. A manhunter pack of tortoises? That's uh that's interesting. So, okay, there's two gone. 
that's three. So these guys are gonna roam into, they're gonna roam down here. So am I able to like save this animal? I'm not sure. So let's build a couple animal sleeping spots. And then let's let's see what we can do about rescuing this husky. I don't think we can do much about it. Um, that's a problem. So she just wandered out there and got bit by a bunch of rabid tortoises or tortai. I don't know what you would call them. So I hope she doesn't bleed to death. Okay, that husky died on the way. We are going to try to lure these... Angry Tortai tortoises over here. Let them uh, let them attack these guys. Uh oh. Nope, you're going the wrong way there, Bonnie. You gotta go this way. Dragon, you... I don't know what the heck you're doing. So we will let our, our, our guests take care of those tortoises. Uh, let's tend to her. Her health is not good. So what did they leave behind? They left uranium. That's crazy. Okay, Bonnie can go back to whatever she was doing. Dragon seems happy-ish. Not super beautiful. He has food poisoning. That doesn't bode well. So, we'll have to kill this tortoise. Bonnie seems to be doing okay. I think we need to kill this tortoise first. How do you have a shooting of 10 and you're still whiffing so bad on a turtle? I just, I don't know. How do you whiff on a turtle? Okay. Okay. I am going to put a cut in here. We have just successfully defended ourselves from some huskies and turtles. Everybody seems to be recovering okay. And we seem to be in a decent spot, although we are low on food. We will uh, pick up in the next episode. I will see you later. Thanks for watching.